In this series, we are going to be starting from absolutely nothing and trying to acquire all the riches that Los Santos has to offer. Welcome to Broke to Ballin'. <laughs> Sorry, that was a bit cringe, wasn't it? I was trying to make this like creepy because, you know, spooky season. I'm a, I'm a devil, but it doesn't really work when it's daytime and I, I couldn't be bothered waiting till night. So uh, this is what you get. But welcome back to Broke to Ball and we are back with another episode this week, not leaving you hanging and blue balled like last time. Apologies for that. But this week we have some English Dave chat to go through. Please shut up. This week, we actually have some very interesting and cool things added to the game in the Halloween, the spooky season spirit. So we have a new treasure hunt, which is basically a ghost hunt. And it basically takes place up in the north of the map. However, you can only do it at a certain time of day. All the locations are between 8 p.m. and 5 a.m., I think, or like 6 a.m. or something like that. So I got to wait. There we go. There's the email. Calling all ghost hunters. Ghost Exposed is coming to Blaine County. We're documenting the most chilling, horrifying blood curdling viral paranormal content and we need I'm assuming that means uh, need help, but you know, I couldn't be bothered reading the rest of it. And we need your submissions. Think you've seen a real ghost? Send a pic today to Ghost Exposed for money. Yeah, so uh, we'll be doing that in a bit, but while we're waiting for the daylight time to change, we can go ahead and do some other things. Mainly, uh, I'm gonna do another time trial very quickly because there's also a new vehicle for us to purchase that goes along with this update. When you complete the ghost hunt mission thing, you get money, but you also get a new livery for a vehicle. Uh, I don't know exactly where this vehicle is. I think it's in Southern San Andreas Super Sport Orders. Here we go, Albany Brigham. Now, you might be thinking, this looks like a pile of shit. It kind of is. It is the the car from the original Ghostbusters, which don't crucify me, but I have not seen. So that's cool. It is 1.5 million though, which is a waste of money. And we do have enough, but I am going to go ahead and get some more because I don't want to be broke ever again. It's not a fun thing. So we're going to go ahead and do this time trial very quickly. I won't bore you. I'm going to get it first time. Trust me. See, I told you. Definitely wasn't stressed at all there. But there we go. Uh, a time trial done. And uh, we can do more. But I feel like that is going to bore you. So let's go ahead and just buy the vehicle and get it upgraded a little bit. Even though I will not use it ever again after this video. I got to figure out some way to make content, don't I? So here we go. The Albany Brigham. I'll get it in a black for now. I'm just going to... Well... I don't know where I was going with that sentence. I'm going to get the dark color because dark means scary. And no, that's don't take that in like a racial way. I swear to God, if you try and cancel me, I will cancel you. Um, uh... Auto shop. Off to a great start with this video. Jesus. So like I said, the first ghost appearance starts at 8 p.m. and it is currently 5.40. So we have a few minutes to get over there. In fact, we might want to get over there now, otherwise I'm going to miss it. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to go ahead and get my presser and head on over to uh, the number one location. You can tell I am so prepared for today's video. Oh boy. Now, in terms of other things that have been added this week, we also have some UFO business battles, which I probably won't take part in because I don't really play in public sessions and don't really do business battles, but they are there. And there's also these, I don't know what to call them. They're like ghost cars that try and kill you and also these murderers that try and kill you vigilantes killers i don't know i think you might have to be in a public session for them i'm not exactly sure but we can go ahead and get them later on they spawn in certain parts of the map at certain times of day and they try and end your life so that's cool i guess i don't really know if there's any reward for it they're just kind of there so we'll give them a check later in the video because again we got to make content somehow and trust me i ain't gonna turn into mr boss for the win FDW. I don't know what he wants me to say. I don't care what he wants me to say. If you see me do a single GTA 6 leak video, please unsubscribe. Like, genuinely. Okay, so the first ghost is located in this barn. I think he can spawn either downstairs or upstairs. So we just gotta wait till 8 p.m., which is in an hour, aka two minutes of real lifetime, and then we will take a photo of the boy. Hopefully he poses for us like a good French girl, but we'll wait and see. So, you come here often? No? I've made this joke before, haven't I? Why do I keep doing it? Well, this is exhilarating. I'm having a great time waiting. And waiting. And waiting. And waiting. And waiting. Oh, and waiting. Yeah, and waiting. Oh, okay, let's stop this. Show yourself. Reveal yourself. Expose yourself. Not in the sexual way, but just, you know, in, in general. And where are you? Hey, it's a baddie. Okay, let's not be weird. So we have a ghost and we take a picture of them and then we send it and then we get money. Thick. Sorry, I'm immature as hell. Send to Ghost Exposed $20,000 and now on to the next one, which is over at a trailer down 
here. And the way this treasure hunt works is the first ghost is available between 8 and 9 p.m. The second ghost is available between 9 and 10 and then so on and so on. And there are 10 ghosts with the final one appearing after you get the first nine. And it is, well, I won't spoil it, but it is a character that you should know from GTA 4 and GTA 5. And he is just kind of dead. So unfortunate. So location two is in this trailer right here, bounty here. And uh, they should just pop up in a window somewhere. And once again, we need to wait and wait uh, and wait. Yeah. Three, two, one. Expose yourself. Hey, there we go. Ghost in the window. You look happy number three over here i am also trying to make this video kind of like a guide to finish it like i'm showing you the locations but realistically if you want to get this done fast don't watch my video i'm very slow and bad at doing things then again i say that with most mo, mo, mm, i can't speak i say that with most things and yet you continue to watch so i i don't really know what's going on with that but uh location three yeah i'm so awkward jesus christ mm, she's a devil wait how does it go mm, she's the devil she's a bad little bit yeah let's not get copyrighted from doja pretty sky though very very scenic i don't usually take a second to just stand here and just appreciate how beautiful this world is it's quite nice i'm i'm a fan jk i'm a human being ha 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 all right just a few minutes away from another ghosty boy or girl because it's been woman so far appearing who's it gonna be this time is it gonna be my father no he's alive well at least i think so dad all right location number four we gotta go over to uh here Yep, that's the location. There we go. Now, for this one, they actually spawn on top of the lighthouse. So they will be up here. Or I think they might be able to spawn below as well. But at least from what I've seen, the boy usually spawns up here. Sorry if that's giving you epilepsy. Uh, uh, apologies. Yeah, there we go. Right up there. The light kind of makes it difficult to see him. But we should be able to snap a photo. And there we go. Is that going to work? Good. On to number five. Mambo, some would say. And it is at this location on the map. Follow Lankman Dan for more helpful guides on how to suck at this game. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay, we're at the location of ghost number five, and they should spawn somewhere on the roof of this house. I don't know which side it actually is. It probably would be helpful if I didn't know, but I'll just wait and find out myself. Have a little bit of fun and spice in life, am I right? Well, they're not there. Or or there. What? Um, hello? Ghosty boy. Am I at the wrong house? I don't think I am. What, where is my guy? He's supposed to be on this house. He's not inside. Dude, there's always something that goes wrong with my channel, isn't there? I can never just do anything smoothly. Where are you, my guy? The hell? I Like, I might be wrong. There's definitely a chance I am, but I don't think so. Mate! Mate! Wh where are ya? Simeon, it's not the time for this. I'm in distress. Oh, are you f***ing kidding me? Are you actually serious, my guy? You've just ruined my entire day in existence. <laughs> I'm so offended right now. Because you know what that means, guys? It means I have to wait another 48 minutes for this time of day to come around again. Are you kidding me? Dude. Uh, huh? Um, mm, uh, okay, sure. Yeah, that makes sense. Apparently, he spawns between 1 and 2 and not 12 and 1. I'm confused. Uh, I guess I was complaining for nothing. Okay, on to the next one, which is over here. D don't worry about my complaining. It happens most videos. Okay, let's move on. Woo! Okay, now there will be someone here as well. I don't know exactly where, but we will figure it out. Uh, this is thrilling commentary, isn't it? Gee, I think he's around the other side, if my tinglings seem to be correct. I don't know what that means exactly, but just deal with it. Should be on top of this building. And then we will go on to ghost numero... Seven, uh, who is up in Polito for some goddamn reason. You don't need to do that yet. That's ahead of schedule. But I will put it on the minimap though, so I just know where to go. Boop. Why are you sliding down the hill? Presser, could you stop that, please? Presser, you're being a bad boy right now. And you know what I do to bad boys? I missed. Come on, show yourself. You know you want to. Look at that boy. No arms, no legs, but it's okay because he can give good head. Okay, why did I say that? Ghost number six done. Keep watching the video, please. I need money. That's is a really vain way to tell you to keep watching. Now you're probably going to click off even more. Oh, well, it is what it is. As they say in France, f*** it, we ball. Oh, there's a UFO over there. Hello, boy. How are you doing? I don't know if I have much time to really go check you out, but there is a UFO, guys. You know what a UFO means? Aliens. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't know if I was trying to make a joke there or not, but UFO. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is... Oh, shit. No, I don't have time for this. What's happening? Did I just get EMP'd? Shit, am I gonna be able to make it in time? I may have just screwed myself out of doing this ghost hunt in one night. 
Ow. Come on, oppressor. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Go, go, go. Get on, get on. Are you going to work? Good. Uh, how much time do we have? Okay, we got time. We got time. Well, I think we have time. So yeah, going near the UFO was a bad mistake. Do not make the same mistakes I do, kids. And adults and babies, if there are any watching. I hope there aren't, actually. That, that'd be really bad. I do not say uh, wholesome things. I swear they're supposed to be in that window. Uh... Oh, you're up there. That's cute. Poking your head out just for me. Thank you very much. Have a good... Uh, afterlife, I guess. Okay, on to ghost number eight, and we have to go all the way back into the Sandy Shores area, I think, or at least somewhere close to there. We need to go all the way down. I'm gonna be honest, I can't even tell where that is on the map. I am very confused. What? Where is- oh, it's here. We have to go there and get there in a short amount of time, which, um, oh, it's gonna be a close one, lads. It's gonna be a real close one. Stay tuned to see if I get it. I feel like I've really given up on trying to make good commentary. Now I just say stupid shit and hope it entertains you. Let me know if it does, because then I'll continue doing that. Okay, it's hit four o'clock. We only have 57 minutes left to get to the place and take a photo. Hold your breath, because this is gonna be a tense one. Not really, it's a, a video game with no stakes, but for me, do it, please. All right, I think we're gonna make it. That is good, because the ghost should be just at this waterfall, and we can see him right up on that ledge. And if you can't see him, um, go to Specsavers. Bike, what are you doing, bike? Hello there, lass. I just like whistled through my teeth there. That's great. Uh, can you let me get on? Thank you very much. And ghost number nine, the final one is up on this bridge. I don't know why we're going back to the direction we came in. Rockstar doesn't like me. And like I said, number nine is somewhere on this bridge. And no, it's not the parachute. Even if you may have thought that. I don't think any of you thought that, don't worry. Now the ghost should spawn between five and six and I believe he's supposed to be on top of the bridge. At least that's where I saw him on the tutorial video I'm watching because I can't figure anything else, any, any, you know what I mean? Uh, but I don't seem to see him, which means Shit. Um, ghosty boy. Hello. Ghosty boy. He's supposed to be right up there. At least that's one of the locations. I don't know uh, where he is. Um, um, where are you, mate? What the f***? Where are you? Oh, God. I'm going to have to wait a whole other day to do this, aren't I? Yep. I'm going to have to wait a whole another day to finish this challenge. I want to end my life and not in a joking way. Why is he not here? I'm sure I'm just being stupid, but he should be up there. Oh, man. God. <laughs> ah. Are you serious? Black from Harry Potter? No, you're not. So, like, <laughs> sake. I have to wait 48 minutes. 48 minutes. God, this is... Ma Baker has so many buns. I'm pissed off. Oh, there's a train coming. Better get out of the way. Oh no, I didn't get out of the way in time. How tragic. I am so upset. Ah, oh, great. My keyboard's not working. That's fantastic. <laughs> Nothing. Oh, I'm getting annoyed. Oh, I'm actually having to do a Google search to figure out where the last ghost is because for some reason, he didn't want to be there and I don't really understand why. All right, well, I'll just watch another video and apparently the ghost can also spawn right in the middle here and I just maybe didn't see him or maybe the game didn't want me to see him because the game, of course, hates me and me alone. I am the number one public enemy of Rockstar Games. They probably don't know who I am, but this is the agenda I'm carrying forward because it's funny. Why is the oppressor going through the wall again? Oh, well. Uh, so I will, I, 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 I am literally going to AFK for the next 40 minutes and just wait until this boy spawns. So, um, yeah, see you then. All right, so I have waited 48 minutes. I've just been sitting here doing nothing because this game has forced me to do that and I hate it for it. But I've been waiting 48 minutes. It is about to hit 4 a.m. very soon and I guess we will see if the ghost actually decides to show up. All right, a few minutes left. He's either gonna be up there or over here. And if he doesn't spawn, I'm going to cry. There was a thunder strike. No ghost though. I'm actually gonna end my life. This has gotta be a joke, right? I've waited 48 minutes for this shit and it still won't work. All right, I've waited another in-game hour just to see if maybe I got the time wrong. And by me, I mean all the people who had tutorial videos. Oh my god, thank you. Literally, I don't know why, but every single video or like website I searched up just had the time wrong. It said from four to five instead of five to six, but there we go. Ghost number nine done, and now ghost number ten. Guess what, guys? We have to wait all the way until midnight again. Woohoo! I don't know why they force us to wait so much, but yes, it is currently 5 a.m. and we have to wait all the way until midnight for the next ghost to show up, which is a massive pain in the ass. So I guess I'll see you then again. And uh, just before I go, I believe the location where he spawns is right about here. Actually, no, maybe it's the next one over. Right about here. Uh, right, right here. This location here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. You get it? Okay, cool. I'll see you uh, in half an hour or something.
Yep. Okay, it is currently 11.30 and yes, I'm back in my regular outfit because I, I don't know, I was getting bored of the other one. But the final ghost should show up here in a very short amount of time, less than a minute now. And if you don't know who he is already, it is Johnny Kravitz. Is that his name? I might be wrong with the name, to be honest. Johnny Klebitz. I don't know why I said Kravitz. That's a, the name of an actress. Um, But he is here as a ghost because he got killed at the start of GTA 5. If you didn't know that already, sorry for the spoiler. The game has been out for 10 years though, so deal with it if i am not mistaken we take a picture of johnny send it into the ghost hunty boys and then we get two hundred and fifty thousand dollars along with the livery for the vehicle we bought that we just haven't got yet because i've been busy waiting so uh he should pop up any second now come on johnny um johnny there he is uh, he's shouting Trevor. I'm trying to get a selfie of him. Wait, I want to get a selfie. Hold on, we've got to be quick though, otherwise I'm going to have to wait another 48 minutes, which I really don't want to do. I just want to get a nice selfie with my boy. There we go. How lovely is that? Absolutely beautiful. We can send that to Ghost Exposed, and there we go. Never mind, we didn't get 250k. We got 250k overall from like doing all of them, but not at the end. Um, There we go. So we got a new livery, I think. We should have got a livery. I don't know where it went exactly. Oh, there we go. 50,000 more dollars, and and top left, the ghost exposed livery has been unlocked at LS Customs for the Albany Brigham. So why don't we, why am I in cinematic mode? Why don't we go ahead and bring our organ uh, out here for us to drive? I am so out of practice of speaking, good lord. So here is the Brigham, the Ghostbusters vehicle. It's pretty shit right now, to be honest. I've never driven it, of course. I've just bought it for the first time. Is it going to be quick? No. Well, let's head on over to LS Customs, the closest one being down here, and put on the new livery and upgrade it just a little bit because it's the first time we've bought a vehicle in quite a while, so why not waste our money once again? Time to fully upgrade this boy. Okay, so this is the Ghost Exposed livery. It's, um... It's kind of shit, to be honest. There are some other ones here that are much, much better and more interesting. So I'm going to go for one of those instead, because let's be honest, this one's kind of dead. I do like the harsh souls, the rusty mission row. We got sugar skulls, which is a bit too hippie for my liking. And then we just got some nice lines. I kind of like these ones, to be honest. They're real... Real nice. Yeah, we're gonna do this. Well, here's the car. We have a, a lot of accessories on it. We got some lights. We got a skull on the front. We got some um, exhausts. Yeah, thank God I'm not like a host of Top Gear. I don't know why I would be. I'm a random 22-year-old kid from Australia, but thank God I'm not because I cannot describe cars very well. Well, this is the new vehicle. It's fully upgraded now, so let's see if it's any faster. I'd be concerned if it wasn't. Still pretty slow, but we'll take it. I can't believe I've spent nearly $2 million on this thing. I want to cry. Lads, I apologize for being all over the place like usual in my videos, but now we are on to the final part for today's episode, and that is going to be finding and hopefully killing the slashers or the vigilantes or the murderers, whatever you want to call them. In this update, there are five different slashers that can spawn in different regions of the map. There is the slasher, the psycho, the driver, the clown, and the clone or lookalike or whatever you want to call it. Basically, someone that looks like me will try and kill me. So fighting my own demons, pretty much. Now, these guys will spawn between... Please focus on me, camera. Thank you. These guys will spawn between 9 a.m., 9 p.m., sorry, and 5 a.m. in certain areas of the map. For example, the driver will spawn either around the stadium or up here in this area. The slasher will spawn at the top of the map. The psycho will spawn in sort of areas in the middle. And the clown will spawn in a big area in the city. And then the person who looks like you, your lookalike, your clone, will spawn in any one of those areas. Now, from what I've heard, these guys are really, really difficult to kill the absolute bullet sponges they basically have hacks on so i'm gonna hope i can kill a few of them see how it goes but it's also 11 p.m and i kind of want to sleep tonight so if i can't manage all of them uh deal with it it's currently 7 18 so we have about two in-game hours aka four minutes until 9 p.m and then after that we can try and start looking for the driver in this area or the clown which is in the city so i'll see you when uh i, I start to get all right, we are merely seconds away from 9 p.m., which means a killer can spawn at any moment. I don't know if it will happen straight away. I don't know if we'll have to be waiting uh, countless hours due to my terrible luck, but it will happen very soon. We can either get the clown, the driver, or myself. Here we go. Uh, we'll start driving, I guess. Now, I believe we are signified by a lightning strike and a red dot on the minimap to let us know when the killer has arrived. So until then, we'll just have to wait, really. Just drive around, have a good time. Cheeky tug at the wheel, you know, normal things. Well, I've been driving around for quite a few minutes yet. Yeah, it is now 11 p.m. and yet no sign of a slasher. 
I'm starting to think they're scared of me due to my massive muscles and incredible skills with women. Well, I guess we'll just keep on chugging along, see if one spawns. Again, it is late at night though, and I kind of want to just sit back, relax, and, and watch what's a show that's funny to watch. Leave it in the comments below. I don't know why I always put on like an American accent when I do that. I think it's just because they're like the typical cringe YouTubers. Sorry, my Americans, you know I already hate on you already. I don't hate you, I hate on you. There's a difference, okay? I love you guys. You know who I don't love, Lowe? The Slasher. Why are they not spawning? Screw looking for the driver specifically. I'm just going to drive around Los Santos and hope someone spawns. Because otherwise, this is a bit of waste of my time. Like most things I do. God damn, I am really, really unlucky. It's nearly 2am now. Only three hours left of in-game time. And still no Slasher. Uh, again, are they really that scared of my ability to speak to women? I, I don't understand what else it is. Why do they not want to come fight me? Lads, I want to make content for the video, please. You know, I'm going to go back to the stadium get out of my car and run around for the final couple of minutes and if no one spawns uh, i'm gonna try again tomorrow because I, I can't be bothered oh no i took someone's ride oh wow a bounty i would care but i don't play in public sessions also the bounties are extremely out of date i make seven thousand dollars in my sleep lad what do you think that's gonna accomplish like i have millions watch this boys ah shit i went the wrong way And still no slasher. Wow, this is... Ooh, I love this. 3 a.m., two hours left. Are we going to get lucky? If we're talking in the sexual way, no. If we're talking in the murderer way, also no. Although at this point, I don't know which one I want more. Watch this, boys. Oh yeah, I can do stunts in GTA. And yet, still no sign of a slasher boy this has been the most depressing few minutes of my gta career and i've done some things some terrible things oh my god he spawned i know they're strong so i gotta be real careful here minigun time who is it it's me guys i'm fighting myself oh my god this is incredible stuff And now he's dead. Well, that's kind of the one I wanted. I wanted to fight myself because I thought it'd be interesting for the video. And now that I've done that, um, see you next time.